who that be? Hood folks. Who we are? Hood folks. Who we do it for? Do it for the hood folks. Who that be? Hood folks. Who we are? Hood folks. Who we do it for? Do it for the hood folks. 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 Yeah, yeah. Hey, what's up, hood folks? This is Jeremy. And the cameraman. Thank goodness. You back in the back again? I, I'm taking it from the back. <laughs> I'm talking, I'm, I'm, what am I doing? I am videoing and I'm behind the camera. So I am videoing from the back. I'm hey, taking it from the back. It's your world, bro. We ain't judging. It's nothing sexual, okay? You see, we, again, we ain't judging. Didn't I tell you in life, don't all of, or don't volunteer information. You could have just shut up. You should have just pleaded the fifth. See, now if you was being interrogated by the police, they would have took that little bit of curls and built a whole damn sandcastle. Hold on, let's do that again. Uh-uh. We're not doing it again. Yeah, I'm doing that again. No. We're not doing it again. Keep going. No, I'm telling you, just keep going. Damn. Anyway, <laughs> hood folks, today is Sunday. Morning, evening, I don't know. It's still daylight, so it's Sunday there, damn it. I'm about to make two recipes. This is not going to be a long video. I promise you it's not. <laughs> I Okay, this is what I was going to make last week. I used to love these little things right here back in the day. What is these called? Taquitos. Taquitos. I used to love these. I used to get them, put them in the oven, and they was dope. But me and Beef has had beef. And... Oh, uh, I just can't fool with beef no more. And I hate, uh, uh, what do you call them? What you call them thing you put in the oven? Enchiladas? Is that the soft thing they saw? Enchiladas? Enchilada. I absolutely hate enchiladas. Ugh. So I'm going to make some Tatitos. And I'm making a second recipe. So we're doing two in one recipe. You're going to get two videos. When this go off, watch the next one. And what are we making again? I don't know what I said. Tatitos. Tatitos. Is that the pizza? <laughs> <laughs> Toast Tito. What they call Taquito. Taquito. I'm pretty sure I could have tell y'all how to win a million dollars tonight, but people will forget all that on here. Oh, oh damn it. It calls Taquito. Taquito. <laughs> <laughs> all right, down here. I hope I got my big pan. I'm going in with some olive oil. I always use olive oil when I cook turkey because it gives that. Olive oil is healthy for your heart. We eat food that's good for your heart and everything. I got three pounds of ground turkey. Now, I'm only going to use... Whoa, listen at that silver. I'm only going to use probably about two pounds because... Let's see. Because half of this meat going to be used for the second recipe we're doing. Now, of course, you can use ground beef, ground turkey, ground chicken, ground pork. Hey, you can use ground dog. And, we beyond, don't... and beyond ground. Yeah, and hot beyond. dog. Yeah, beyond meat. You can make this a vegan version. I would have made this a vegan version. Well, meat-free version, not vegan version, because I'm pretty sure when y'all see the cheese. Oh, no, that ain't vegan. That's cheese. <laughs> I couldn't be that kind of person in life. Then you got to be a miserable loser to be on social media or in life in general and every time somebody say anything you've got think it's your obligation to correct them i don't correct nobody i don't correct nobody i'm not an auto correct anyway beef bouillon um i use beef bouillon because it give it that beef flavor without eating beef that's if you still like beef now if you could take turkey i usually don't like turkey by itself i just like the beef flavor and i'm losing about two Tablespoon because we want it to be flavorful, not salty, but flavorful. All right, and that's all my salt content I'm using in this. Damn, that smells like some noodles. Roman noodles, yeah, them Roman noodles. Yeah, if you have some Roman noodles and you run out of that little season pack, just put you some beef bouillon, chicken bouillon, and in there, and you got the same situation going on. All right, so let's let this cook. And we'll be back in five minutes. I'm just playing. <laughs> okay, now, hood folks, here is your ground beef substitute. <laughs> your ground turkey 
is completely done. I cooked mine to it looks like it looks like ground beef, don't it? Yep. All right, so since we're making two recipes today, we're gonna divide this in half, like a wedding divorce. Well, divorce. We're gonna split everything in half, 50 50. Well, that looks like uh, this was short side. Get. This was short side. This is my side. <laughs> <laughs> but we're gonna divide it in half. And since we're talking about wedding, no, we we'll never get married. That's an abomination. God made Adam and Eve, not Adam and Steve. No, they didn't. <laughs> he, he did do that, but we, we're we just not getting married. We support you. Uh-oh, here you go. This ain't that type of video. This supposed to be comedy and joking. Here you go, keeping it too real. But no, nah, seriously, we're going to take this. Now, all that look like fat, but it's not fat. It's grease that we need for the next recipe. So, I'm taking my little handy down the bowl that we got on after Christmas sale, half off for a dollar. Yeah, it was a dollar. And we ain't going to use... Let's see. Okay, we're gonna use this side right here, the west side, for the uh, the ampaladas. Uh, Why well, can't say ampalada? What, what the name of the recipe is, boy? Taquitos. Taquitos. Wait, is that right? Y'all, yeah. I be forgetting. I y'all, my mind is. I be forgetting. So I might call it burrito, taco, chitlins. You know, <laughs> you might hear me call it Thanksgiving down. Happy Thanksgiving shit. So I'm gonna take this bit right here. All right. And this is what I'm gonna use for the video. For the, this, uh, Tatito. <laughs> what you got? Taquitos. Okay. Ah. All right, here folks, so I'm gonna take my meat. Add it to this bowl. Now, I made my own taco seasoning. If I don't forget, I'll put a link in the a, a comment, link in the description box on how I made this on one of my other videos. Um, this is a pound of meat, ground turkey, and this is salt free. Can they see this good? Yes. Can they see all this good? Yes. All right, so I'm gonna put about this much on here. Once again, this is salt free, no salt is in here. And we're gonna do a third of a cup of water. You smell that taco seasoning, boy? Yes. Smell good, don't it? Sure do. I'm waiting to stuff my mouth, put them down. What you call them again, empanadas? <laughs> <laughs> I don't know what I call them. It's this dude I watch on Instagram, and every time he cook, he be leaning on the counter, and when he tastes it, his reaction be like, it be so good. I be like, man, he can cook too. That boy can cook. I be seeing a lot of good cooks on Instagram. Oh, shit. I be seeing a lot of good cooks on Instagram. They really be cooking, cooking. But the video be so short though. That's in that, that's in that's more doing that video for a minute. It's harder than doing this video because it's so much editing and cutting and splicing. And putting, that takes too long. But anyway, so we're just gonna let this go on and cook down and simmer and just come together for about two more minutes. All right, folks. So I'm gonna use these low carb wraps right here. These are keto friendly. Whole wheat, low carb. They have uh, 11 grams of total carbs, but dietary fiber carbs are eight grams, which make these three grams of net carbs. So these are very carb friendly, low carb, healthier, will not spike your blood sugars. All right, so come over here, here go my meat. And it's ready to go. Season to perfection. So let's bring this right here. You in the frame? I'm in the frame. All right. I'm gonna take my meat, put my meat on like that. Now you can use whatever kind of cheese you like. I'm just using some reduced fat, sharp cheese. Reduced fat, sharp. And I'm gonna roll it like this, real tight. Without spitting all my flavors out. And we're just gonna place it in there like that. Let's do that again for the ones in the back. <laughs> I hate that damn free. Uh, <laughs> take the cheese like this and roll it. You getting it good? Yeah, I'm getting this one good. 
I'm talking about you get me rolling it. Yes. You got to be on the camera, man, and put it out like that. And then you take this little piece right here and eat it. <laughs> All right, let me roll. Uh-uh. I'm getting them little booger fingers out there. Let me roll the rest of these up right here. I right, here, folks. I'm going to turn these over. Like that. Oh, that's hot. Shoot all like that. It'll take long to brown these up. Oh, that cheese is melting inside of them. You know, it looks so good. If y'all was thinking about getting this hot plate right here, we using don't. I don't think this hot plate by then either. I'm just gonna go and get me a high end one because this one right here was what I think like thirty dollars. Yeah. And that first one we had was trash, but I'm had to go and get me just a good good one. The one with the numbers on, you know, you press the button. The one like Pat Neely be using. <laughs> oh yeah, I started watching his uh, some of his show uh, videos too. You go watch this out. See what's All right, here, folks. And our whatever they call are done. Taquitos. Taquitos. All right, here, folks. So here they go. Fresh out the out the pan. Ooh, they so good. I know they good. I ain't even taste them yet. But the last time I made these, they were so damn good. Yeah, they were. Ah, right, you can do any kind of filling you want. I made these a couple times. One time I made him some eggs and bacon put in it and cooked it like this. And then another time I made him some, oh, what else I put in? Some sausage and bacon. Yeah. Sausage eggs. I can't stand when people do this when they talk. So do this as well. And then you take it two minutes and you do it like that. And then you put your sour cream up. I can't stand with people. I'll be one of, okay, this ain't the type of video. My bad, y'all. All right, so this is how we're going to dress them up. You can eat them like that. You can do them like that if you want to. Or you can dress them up like you need to. Let's get a closer view of them first. Ooh, look at that. What you call this again? I'll be forgiving, y'all. Taquitos. Taquitos, okay. All right. Let's get a profile picture. Now let's dress them up then. Yeah, let's, 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 let's dress them up for the party and then put them out there. <laughs> All right. So I'm gonna put I'm gonna put a little bit of lettuce on here like that. Just a little bit of lettuce, and then a little bit of squirt. Should I do a circle or a dollop? Let's do it. Uh, let's do a circle like this. Some sour cream like that, and. I got some taco seasoning, taco bell seasoning. And let's just give it a drizzle like this. Now, of course, you're going to add more when you're to eat it, right? Now, let's get another close up view to get the profile picture. Don't look good, hood folks. Look at all that meat busting out. Look at that. Yeah. All right. It's gonna give it a taste test. I have, I have an avocado. I don't know if it's good or bad. It's been sitting on the counter for a couple of days. If it's bad, you'll see it bad with me. If it's good, we'll see it good, we'll eat it. But if not, then let's see. What you think? Bad. Ooh, that ain't too bad. You just pick around the black stuff. Yeah. Just pick around the black stuff and eat the other stuff. And I know some people ain't gonna be told, ooh, that's a, that's a little too black. Let us see the back of your neck. <laughs> Own them thighs up, what is that down there? Okay. Don't be tripping. Ain't nothing wrong with blackness. Look, black ain't never killed nobody. Unless it was poison. Okay. All right. Let's go. <laughs> let's get a little of that sour cream. A little of that lettuce. This avocado. You ready? Mmm. <laughs> Mm, look at that. I ain't gonna say that. I'm gonna say some real nasty. Mm -mm. Mm. It's seasoned good. It's real flavorful. It's not soft like a burrito. It's a little lip crunch to it, not crunchy crunchy. Now, if you use regular tortilla shell, it's gonna be crunchy. But since these are low carb, they are not as crunchy. Mmm. -hmm. This is good. This is good. 
Mm-hmm. I ain't gonna eat too much because I'm ready for the second recipe. Look, look, come on, tell you. Mm-hmm. All right, well, folks, so let me see how these things really taste. Let's see if they're really good this time. Mm-hmm. Go for my cream. Some avocado. We can't see you getting the camera. Bend down. Oh. They good. Real good? Yeah, they real good. Are they soggy? The meat isn't good. No, it's not soggy. It's like, it's stiff. Yeah. Mm. Uh-oh. Yeah, these are real good, huh, folks. Didn't put a lot of cheese in it, which I'm okay with, because I don't want the cheese to overpower the uh, flavor. Ow, ow, ow. But yeah, this is good, baby. You did this. All right, so tell them what all they need to do. Mm. Y'all make this recipe now. No trip. Especially on that low carb. You're trying to eat a little healthier. You heard that word, a little healthier. You don't have to get in the comment. Oh, that ain't healthy. Your lifestyle ain't healthy either. <laughs> it's, it's wrong. And God ain't pleased. <laughs> <laughs> okay, go on, man. I'm through clown. I hope a like, comment, subscribe, and press that ugly ass bell button to get notified whenever we put up new content on this page. And stay tuned, it's going to be a whole new video coming up right about now.